Because I'm trying to understand why you, you looked at that and thought, do you know what? Absolutely not. I'm not going to drink as yeah. much as I was. Yeah. So basically, alcohol was causing leaky gut. Oh, leaky gut. Okay. Yeah. So alcohol was causing leaky gut. That's what, that's what we saw in that study. And the fact that the amount of leaky gut was proportional to the amount of alcohol in the blood and that the leaky gut did not return to normal until the alcohol level was zero says to me that any amount of alcohol that's detectable in the bloodstream can create this problem. Which is going to cause inflammation. Which is going to cause inflammation. We know with total clarity that people who are heavy drinkers, their gut is totally destroyed. And that that's actually a requisite step on the pathway towards developing cirrhosis and alcoholic liver disease. But when I saw this, I saw enough to say, I don't think there's any amount of alcohol that's safe. To summarize what's going on there, the alcohol is coming into the body. It is impacting the gut in some way, which is making the gut go into dysfunction. And that dysfunction lasts for a little while. 